Somewhere in the middle of the Pacific Ocean, half a world away and steeped in legend, paradise can be found on the Polynesian island country of Samoa. Made up of two main islands, Savai and Upulu, and six smaller ones, it's believed an ancient warrior people settled here 1,000 years BC. The now mainly agriculture-based population of 180,000 can grow many crops here, from coffee, cocoa and bananas, to pineapples, ginger and vanilla. Not surprising then, that this green and fertile land is so rich in biodiversity. An early morning sun drenches the warm crystal waters, while the coconut plantations, surrounded by lush green forests, heave with activity. Isaako Faleoa lives on Savai, the most westerly island of Samoa. He is one of 200 organically certified farmers in the country. And, as you can imagine, he knows a thing or two about why Samoan coconut oil is so good. Legend even claims that the very first coconut palm grew right here in Savai. It's 7 a.m. and while the morning is still cool, Izaiko and his extended family collect coconuts by hand, as they have done for generations, never picking directly from trees. Once the gathering and loading is complete, and before the tropical sun reaches its highest point, everyone returns to the shade of the farm to begin crafting the coconuts into community trade, organic, cold-pressed virgin oil. First, they husk the nuts, carefully selecting each one to make sure they are of the highest quality. One farmer describes checking the smile of the face. It has to be brown and flat. Every coconut is checked at least four times. Now the best nuts are ready to be cracked open. This can be thirsty work in the sweltering heat, but fresh juice is always to hand. These premium quality nuts have every right to feel good about themselves. Now they are ready to be grated and transformed into cosmetic nectar for the skin. The grated flesh is weighed before being transferred to the drying bed. Nothing is wasted. The discarded husks are used to fuel the warming beds. It's vitally important that the luscious flesh is gently warmed to ensure the water content evaporates. The coconut is continually stirred and checked for any imperfections. After approximately 45 minutes, the coconut flesh is weighed again. By now it should have halved in weight. It takes 10 coconuts to make one litre of oil. Producing coconut oil here dates back to the 1800s. It's been used on skin for as long as people can remember. And there appears the community trade organic, cold-pressed virgin coconut oil. Samoa is so remote, it is the last place on earth to see the sunrise. And despite being an unspoiled paradise, there are very few opportunities to earn money. World markets demand large quantities of mass-produced crops, something small-scale family farmers cannot provide. So many young people leave Samoa in search of sustainable incomes elsewhere. Yet, through the work of Women in Business Development Incorporated, rural communities in Samoa are benefiting from a revival in traditional crafts and farming practices. When Women in Business introduced the body shop to Izaako and the other Samoan organic farmers, we knew that when it comes to skincare, we be doing what comes naturally. Community trade is so much more than treating our farmers with respect and dignity. It's about a quality exchange. You get a great product, we get an amazing ingredient, and our producers get a fair, long-term wage. 
from the land of legends, we bring you our top-selling range of bath and body care products enriched with the finest organic, cold-pressed virgin coconut oil from Samoa.